Very good. What do you know? The kid can whistle. Today it's Friday. I'm going to start this day working at home with some coffee. In an hour or so, I'm going to leave the kids at daycare. In previous episodes, I did once try to work with the kids at home, but it's really hard. If they're not trying to kill me, they're trying to kill each other, so I wouldn't recommend it. Anyway, you can check out the link up here, the previous vlog, when I was fighting with the kids. It's a bit in, in the vlog. I'm just finishing up uh, the video for yesterday, putting in some annotations on YouTube cards and whatever. It's a lot to learn when you're trying to do this YouTube thing, but it's a lot of fun as well. I also have some interesting news for the upcoming weeks. There are actually several things going on, but I'm gonna mention two of them. So, first one is that I did apply for a program to help people who are escaping all the evils of the world. And what I mean is war. People escaping from war, especially in the Middle East. Usually you cannot do that much. Uh, I mean, it's the family life, full-time job, you have a mortgage to pay, you know, pretty much the same thing as everybody. But then I saw this opportunity where you can help an engineer who works within the same field of expertise as yourself, who has recently arrived to Sweden, and you can be a mentor for this person. So a few days back I got this email. Congratulations, you have been chosen, blah blah. It pretty much says I'm chosen. So what this means is that in two weeks I will meet this person and some other people who has been chosen for a mentorship. This is the first time ever that I'm really going to be able to affect the life of somebody who has come here to Sweden hoping to build a new life since their old life was crushed in the war. I'm actually thinking about making an entire video about this event or should I say about the experience of helping somebody. I think it's gonna get really emotional from time to time to hear what they have gone through. I, I can't imagine it. It's so brutal. But for now, let's just do some work and then drive into the office. It's Friday for God's sake. I kind of forgot I said it was two things. First thing, the mentorship. Second thing, we are going on a trip. So I just got word from my office that we will do a trip to Hong Kong in November. Probably have gotten the new drone, the DJI Mavic. So I will bring it with me to Hong Kong and I will bring the camera thingy with me and everything. <laughs> Expect a full scale review of Hong Kong. But now I really need to work. I mean, check out the weather. It's super windy today. It was like a rainstorm. Fuck the shit. Rainstorm yesterday was just crazy. Here we go. Let's look at the car. It's super dirty again. And it was so clean just a week ago. You remember how clean it was? Go, 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 go. Move it, move it, move it, move it. Hey kids, want to hear a good song? Yeah! The SoundCloud. just arrived at work and it is like crazy winds today the car was going like this on the highway but it worked out good anyway so let's go inside to the it is really windy today today is friday friday is pizza day right and by the way this guy just got married 
Congratulations! Thank you didn't you. tell us about it, so we'll, we'll do a secret Sven Sexa when you're not ready. Bachelor party. My name's Alan and I bought a giraffe! Oh, my life is great! <laughs> How do you feel about being kidnapped? I'm gonna put you in a bag and send you to Hong Kong. Yeah. No, to Fleckefjord. <laughs> yeah, it's the same travel time to Norway as Hong Kong. Yeah, man. You can call me Mr. Oh, Shit. The plan is we're going to eat tuna pizza in Zumbiberi, aka Sumpan. Also with Bernays sauce, it's very important ingredients in the pizza. I've been working out, you know. I have pain everywhere. Just gonna go for a salad. I need to lose some weight for this raw salad run. Link in the description for when we're working out for it. Tuner salad. I'm gonna go for a tuner. Let's try this again. Super awesome! Yeah, I'm good. That means good. Yeah, I'm good. That means good. It's a storm! Storm! <sighs> We're back at the office and we need coffee. Right, guys? Coffee! You don't have to understand the battery at the fair. That's about enough work for today, guys. Time for the weekend. Have a nice weekend, guys. See you around. <laughs> Thank you. The smell of the weekend. Still a lot of wind outside. I bet you can hear it in the microphone. I'm being lazy today, so I'm not using this beautiful beautiful socket which also is called dead cat you put it on the microphone but we're just gonna ride in the car so never mind extra lens for car yeah Gucci. Just a quick stop here at the local store. This morning I had a really, really nasty incident. We were out of bacon. Yeah, no big, you'll probably say, but every Friday morning I eat bacon and scrambled eggs. It's like a pre-weekend thing, just to have a nice time and relaxing for the weekend. So this Friday morning we were out of bacon. It was a big disaster. I had to eat uh, bloody yogurt or something. It was terrible. And now I'm gonna correct it. So I'm gonna eat bacon the entire weekend, every morning. Bacon and scrambled eggs. Right. Yeah, you, you get it. I'll spin you all the way home from here. Ready? And we're home. And in the spin, I also picked up the kids. Say hi, William. Hi. Hi. Finally, the family can start the weekend. So the kid just told me, hey, dad, I want to play soccer out in the storm. Well, I'll tell them, if you want to play soccer, I'm going to need my glasses. And also, I will need my jacket. And of course, my cup of coffee. Great, let's play. Is 
said neighbor again. So this day is going to an end. Today my neighbor is gonna end this vlog. Say something smart. That's not to, <laughs> to put pressure. On no anyone. pressure. I will edit out all the things you say wrong. So just go for it. I comment upon one thing. He got nothing. Okay. I got nothing. Bye bye. Bye bye. See you another day. <laughs>